Wait, we haven't met, have we? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. Hang on, Director. Is this who I think it is? Yes, this is our Academy's newest student, Master Rurik. He will be attending as of today. Is your other kid who moved in up the road? I've been dying to find out more about you. I'm Nimona. Normally I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Wanna be friends? No! Yeah. Love that enthusiasm. We're gonna get along just fine. Mr. Mona is president of our student council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. Absolutely love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should battle right now, you and me. Easy now, you two will be in the same class, so you have plenty of time to battle later. And get to know one another better, of course. We're gonna be neighbors and classmates? Nice! We'll be able to battle all we want. On that note, Master Rurik. Have you decided which of these Pokemon would you would like to be your first partner? Mm-hmm. That's Sprigatito, a grass type Pokemon. It can use its plant powers to soak up whatever water you throw at it. Would you like to go with our good grass type Pokemon, Sprigatito, here? Yes. You chose Sprigatito. Would you like to give Sprigatito a nickname? Of course I would. Now the question is what nickname? And this is the segment that's going to get cut out the most when I do my editing, and it's going to be the most work for me, is uh, cutting out nicknames, because they take a while. Uh... Cool, let's go with that. Should fit. We are going with Coriander. Hey, without intending it, it matches my hair. I did not think about that. Whoops. Oh, well, nice surprise. Rikatito seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Master Rurik. This is your first Pokemon, yes? Please raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. They don't even do the, like... They just hold it out now. Alright. I can't believe you actually chose Sprigatito. I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. You should make such a good combo. Can I choose one of these Pokemon too, Director Clavel? Oh, but did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy, Mr. Mona? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Rurik while he raises his own new part. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on an equal footing with Master Rurik here, I should be more than happy to allow it. Yes! And so you're going to choose Quaxley? Since Rurik chose Frigatito, I'll go for this little one. Nice to meet you, Quaxley. Welcome to the team. Alright then, now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. As you may have noticed, Mr. Mona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling. But I do hope you'll join her for a battle. It'll help you get to know your own Pokemon as well. I suppose. I don't know, Mona. 
Yeah, I'm gonna go ransack your house first. What the hell, just how spacious are these places? This painting is entitled Sibling Love. It's pretty charming. Fancy. This painting is entitled Gleaming Seas. It's gorgeous. For the Pachirisu. Oh dear, a visitor. My apologies, both the master and mistress of the house are away at present. Baffling, it truly is. Where does dust come from? I find just as baffling as the things that Pokemon can do. A Gumi and a, uh... Why? Yeah, Gibble, that's it. I was really struggling to think of its name. This painting is entirely the Hidden Ninja. Is it supposed to be a Pokemon? I assume it's supposed to be a, uh... Greninja. Do you have anything hiding out in your ground? Oh look, you do. Another potion. You just have a full battle court down there on the beach. I assume Pokemon don't spawn until I actually do this battle. And so I'm perfectly safe to just wander around. But that also means I can't get an extra Pokemon to uh, make the fight even less even for her. Over here! Anyone can be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have Pokemon by the side. It's our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger through battle. So, you ready to battle me, Ruru? Perfecto. I'm so excited. For this battle, I think I'll use... Miss Nimona. I trust you remember that Master Rook is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. Eh, whoops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. Come on, Rick, let's have us a fruitful battle. You were challenged by Pokemon trainer Nimona. It's the Quaxley. I know this is your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. Oh no, I'm gonna destroy you. Hey, okay, what are these new sprite like these new UI elements? I already have a grass type move to start with. Okay. You must have been studying up. Smart move. Grass is strong against water. No, it's just called I'm um, dirty and I know how to do this. It's super effective. Hey, level up for Coriander. Wow, not bad, neighbor. I mean, would have been hard to lose that. Look at you, winning your first battle ever. You've got even more potential than I thought. You're going to be a strong trainer for sure. But now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again, just one more battle. Master Roar against Frigatito are surely wary or ready from that last battle. No, no, we're fine, we can keep going. Show me your level 80 at Pokemon. Ah, oh, sorry, I got kind of caught up in all the excitement. I'm really sorry, Rogue. Same to you, Sprigatito, too. Same to your Sprigatito, too. Let's battle again soon. 
Ah, definitely. We'll definitely battle more. You two seem to be becoming fast friends, so your friend just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Mr. Mona? I'm sure you can learn a great deal from a champion ranked trainer such as yourself. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me, since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you definitely need. You have a smartphone. Oh, whoops, wrong person. You have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a sec. The Pokedex app was added to your right on phone. The Pokedex will automatically register any Pokemon you catch. It's a must have for Pokemon trainers. The super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jacques, actually made it himself. Like in my day, we use ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. It's quite the age we live in now. Filling out a Pokedex by hand? I can't even imagine how much work that would take. Oh ho oh, oh, ho, no, I suppose you can't. Yeah, calling it here, Clive was able. Yet no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. This is truly a timeless pleasure. And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard towards the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. Now, Mr. Mona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. But I depend on you to see Master Rurik to the Academy. You'll be doing me quite the favour. Of course, leave it to me. Now leave him in your capable hands. Alright, little one, it's time you and I were on our way. Yeah, boy, Coco. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work in my Pokédex along with all my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokédexes, Rue, you've probably never caught a wild Pokémon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the Academy. Come with me. Do I have to? I know how to catch a Pokémon. This isn't the first time that I have, uh... Played a Pokemon game. The handy Rotom phone is a popular item used throughout the Paldea region. Adding apps to it gives the trainer access to a variety of useful functions. Using the map app, you can find useful information about the Paldea region. If you move the map cursor over your own icon and then move the right stick from side to side, you rotate your own view along with the map, handy for getting yourself oriented. You can use the left stick to move the magnifying glass around the map and find locations. Select the location by pressing the A button and you can set it as your next destination. The flying taxi can take you to some places you've visited before. Places that you can fly to are indicated with feather mark. Try taking flight. So I can fly home. There was a grotto there that by looks of it can only be accessed by sea. These are the Pokemon centers, there's the city and the academy. Ah, and I'm all the way down here, right. That's a lot of Pokemon centers all around. Ah, oh, that's what's going on. Yep. So again, this is a really small part of the map, but no, this is the whole map. It's just so I was not oriented to the north. Okay. Nope, I want to go back. And the Pokedex app. Battle or catch Pokemon to compile volumes in your Pokedex app with fancy covers for Pokemon you've caught. Open up your Pokedex to view all the volumes you've collected on a digital shelf and check out what rewards you can earn by pressing the X button. Press the plus button when looking at a Pokemon you've registered in your Pokedex and you can check where that Pokemon's habitat to learn more about where they can be found and when they're active. Explore different areas as you adventure and meet tons of Pokemon.
Parsley doesn't have anything. Sprigatito. Has no habitat. Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. While its scent, its body gives off, mesmerizes those around it. The scent grows stronger when this Pokemon is in the sun. It's a cool little feature. We have two battles, one corp, and zero badges, zero shiny Pokemon. I like that it tells you how many shiny Pokemon you've seen now. Okay, let's get going, shall we? Run, Hurric, run! Oh, Rurik! I hear that Nimona here will be taking you to school? That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. And I read all about the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you at the school. There's so many handy facilities you can use as much as you like. Adding a new friend to Mona, it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Now, you'll be staying in the school dorms, so I want you to promise me you eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed a lunch for your first day. You received the sandwich from Mum. Oh, and maybe you'd take, better take these, too. Use them on that precious little partner of yours to get hurt in battle. I know every day in your life is going to be full of exciting event experiences far from home. Just try to savour them all, the good times and the hard times, too. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. Oh, alright then. You two would better be off, I suppose. Take care on your way to school. Your mother's so nice, bro. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, come on. This way. If Dora the Explorer has taught me anything, that is indeed Spanish, meaning this is indeed said in Spain. I can get Weasel and... I don't remember what that one's name is, right? But it turns into a billion. Coco Path. Alright, this here is Poco Path. It's the path that leads to adventure for you and me. Out here, things are different than in town. You're going to see wild Pokemon out and about. I'll be on the path and in the grass and such. Get too close to one and you have to battle. But you've got Sprigatito for that, right? If you want to try and catch a Pokemon, you gotta use a good old Pokeball. I've got tons, have a few. Thank you. Oink, oink. Ooh, what luck! Time for some learning by doing. Try battling this Lechonk. They knew what they were doing. Rick? Okay, Lechonk. Let's do this. What was that jump? 
You can try and catch a wild Pokemon you're battling by pressing the X button and throwing a Pokeball. When you're having a hard time catching your Pokemon, try to deal damage to it before throwing another Pokeball. That should give you a better chance of success. Pretty sure the trunk is not a water type. It is not. Ball, go! Registered. The Chonk. The Hog Pokemon. This Pokemon spurns all but the finest of foods. This body gives off a herb-like scent that bug Pokemon detest. Would you like to give Lechonk a nickname? Of course we do. It is. Pork chop. Pork chop has been added to your party. That was awesome! You caught the very first Pokemon you went for! I'm crummy when it comes to actually catching Pokemon. Maybe you should give me tips. Is that because you tend to just knock them out, Nimona? Anyway, have some more Pokeballs just in case. Not every catch works out. Ooh, 10 more Pokeballs. That's plenty. Weaken the Pokemon, then throw the Pokeball. Remember that and you'll be fine. Now go battle those wild Pokemon and catch some of them. Do I have to? Let's meet up at that lighthouse over there. You can see our school from the top. The Pokemon you see wandering around in tall grass, caves and elsewhere are wild Pokemon. When you run into a wild Pokemon, a Pokemon battle will begin. You can also start a battle by looking toward a wild Pokemon and throwing one of your Pokeballs at it by using the ZR battle. Let's tactic out to battle Pokemon that are up in trees or flying in the sky.